everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel today we i have another wish haul for you guys i think we're on the third wish haul <laughs> Yes, lots and lots of items from Wish. I have a bunch here, I'm not kidding. <laughs> I have eight items that I'm ready to get into. And the sad part is I still have a bunch of items coming in, so there will be more Wish hauls to come. So without further ado, let's open our first package. Okay. I think I know what this one is. That kind of worries me, because it sounds like something's broken. That would be a great way to start off this video. A broken item. Okay, this should be... I ordered a lipstick, like, case, container, holder. Yeah, it, it did get broken. Well, that makes me a little sad, but it doesn't stop the function of it because it's not like a huge chunk of it. If you see on the side there, that huge crack there. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it holds quite a few of them. I've got a ton of liquid lipsticks recently from my uh, Shop Miss A haul, so <laughs> I need somewhere to put them. And, you know, it was a pretty good price for it. I kept looking for the cheapest one I could find. But that just, yeah, that makes me a little sad. But maybe I can fix that with some hot glue or something. Yeah, this one was $3. Next item. Ooh, oh, it looks really pretty too. I got one of those beauty blender egg crates or holders or whatever you want to call them. Eh, nice. I'm glad that they didn't come in crooked or anything. I saw a few people when they received them in from shipping and everything, they were like a little bent or something. This one came in fine. It's a nice color, it's supposed to be rose gold. Very springy. Yeah, that'll work out really nice because usually my beauty, <laughs> any beauty blender sponge type of thing whatever um i usually just set on my desk or something like that and i don't like just leaving it out i like it to at least this keeps it off of my desk and it can still air out this one was also two dollars third item yeah i got really close to cutting the item i didn't even mean to oh i am so happy okay i will probably be changing my shirt just so i can wear this for the rest of the video it's a Harry Potter sweater. Ah. I am such a nerd and that's okay. I love my Harry Potter. Ooh. Look at that. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy right now. I bought this in a medium in a light gray. It fits pretty well. I can pull it down just a little bit. Material is a little, little scratchy. But I feel like after I get washed, it's not gonna be any problem. It's not short or anything. It has like a slight bagginess to it at the bottom, which I actually kind of like. I'm really liking this. Okay, I need to stop. <laughs> and I only paid $7. Next one. And I'm already pretty sure I know what this is just by the sound that I'm hearing. I decided to order a bunch of chopsticks. I looked at a bunch of different ones. They all had different patterns and everything, but some of them, if you wanted like a really nice pattern, it was just getting way too expensive. And I'm like, I just want some simple chopsticks that I can use, uh, but they're stainless steel chopsticks. I do think it's funny for them to fit it into the package. They did rip off the top here. It's kind of funny, but I'm gonna open these up because I want to see how good they are. Oh, okay. I don't feel like the pattern's gonna come off that easily, which is nice. Pretty good quality, not bad. There's the pattern on it, so you guys can see that a little bit better. And these were only $3. Yeah, and there's five chopsticks in here. That's not bad. Okay, next item. <laughs> okay. You might think this is really weird, but I've heard of this for a while. I've seen a few people test them out. I think I even saw a video on BuzzFeed it's a cup that suctions to your leg and is supposed to help with cellulite. Um, but yeah, you're just supposed to like squeeze it and let go and it's supposed to suction to your leg and you're supposed to like move it around and it's supposed to help with cellulite. So, hmm. doesn't smell horrible, which is good because some things from Wish really smell bad. And I only paid two dollars for next. My packs are that. Okay, I have this one and two other packages. Oh, this is the uh, nail, nail, um, nail plate. 
think of the name. The packaging is really nice on this. Born Pretty. <laughs> very cute. BornPrettyStore.com. You don't see that very often with Wish. Usually it's just from, you know, random places or it's in a little small bag. Oh, ho, ho. they're so cute. Oh, I saw this on there and they're pandas. They're little pandas. I hope I can get it without the glare. You guys see all those? These are so cute. I want to do my nails now. And this is only $2. We'll do the smaller package first and then we'll have one more after this one. You guys can hardly tell what this is, but I know what it is. Um, I kept seeing on Wish, it's called U Unicorn Oil. It's supposed to be a very blinding liquid highlight. The sticker on the bottle is a little worn, is the only thing that kind of troubles me. But there you go. I honestly do not know if this is supposed to be a knockoff or something. I, I have no clue. They did have three other colors, but I ended up purchasing the Moonbeam color, so we're gonna open that. I'm gonna try that on my hand, do a little swat. A lot thicker than what I thought it was gonna be. Okay, put that on my hand first and try it out, but... Whew. Okay, so that's the color. It's shiny, don't get me wrong, but it's a little like thick and watery at the same time. I don't know how to explain it. It does smell really good. Kind of smells like a perfume. But yeah, I don't know. I just, I don't feel like that would sit on top of foundation very well. I don't know, I'll have to try that out later on, but the formula just doesn't look that great. I don't know, I'm trying to smooth it down more to see if it like blends better. It's doing a little bit better. I think I just had a lot on there, but I don't know. That looks a little bit better to me. Cause for a little while it was just too chunky. It was nasty, I don't know. What is that one and this was $2. Okay. Very last item, guys. Um, oh, I think this is the dress that I bought. This is like a, t -sh a tank top dress that I bought. Yeah, there's just a funny line down the front of that. That looks really short. Love to see. Did I order a large? I highly doubt I ordered a large. Okay, I'm looking at the item right now on my phone and I ordered a medium in black, but they gave me a large. You guys see them on the tag. It's also on the back, the tag there. I mean, I'm gonna try it on, but it does look a little different than what it does on the picture, at least the material does. Also, I think this panel, there's like a panel that's on the inside here. And I'm almost gonna guarantee that my boobs are not going to fit into that. They're probably gonna be lower. <laughs> All right, here is the dress on for you guys. It's a little itchy. And yeah, you know that panel thing that I was talking about? It's literally right here. It's literally at my nips. <laughs> as it goes across, so it's, I don't know if you're supposed to have like really small chest for this or what, but yeah, that's not working. But yeah, I just, and it feels, I don't know, part of it's because of the light, but it just makes me look really unflattering. At least to me it does. That and this is a little weird to me because it kind of like sticks out here and then it's got the strap. Like it doesn't seamlessly go up. This one was $6 and Okay, that is all the items that I have for you guys today from my wish haul. Some pretty good items. I'm not gonna lie, I am loving this sweater. I am so happy. That's the thing with clothing with wish. Sometimes it's a hit and sometimes it's a miss. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad that they gave me a large in this thing because otherwise I don't know if it would have even fit but I'm still not that happy with it. I don't know, we'll, we'll see. But yeah, I think the panda plate's so cute and this I'm just in love with. It's just, yeah, it's some pretty good items. I can't, I can't complain that much. <laughs> but thank you all for watching. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you like me, then please subscribe. Thank you.